boys! Today! Yeah, we got a bunch of food from in and out We're gonna eat it all and be gluttonous. The plan is simple! Yeah! Wahoo! I got a few in and out facts. Hit me with some in and out facts. In and out was California's first drive-thru hamburger. Boo! Next fact. The creator of in and out became famous for being the first man to do a live goat seat at a restaurant unveiling. <laughs> now you're just playing with my heart. <laughs> Today, we are gonna try the entire menu of California's greatest in and out Starting in Baldwin Park, California in 1948. It's now all across the Western hemisphere of the United States. This is such a dumb speech. You don't need to do this. Why are you contextualizing in and out This is not a nationwide chain. This is not even outside the country, really. And it's a thing that people from California are like, this is the place. Yeah, there, Fuck there's you. gonna be, the comments in this video are gonna be so many people just fucking pulling out like AK-47s at each other, being yeah. like, the, you, uh, in and out fucking sucked, it's mid. in and outs fucking great, fuck you. And they're like, just fucking going at each other. And the thing is guys, it's just good for the price. We're gonna find out. That's literally We're it. gonna find out. Cause they're, they have like a few things they do. It's mainly burgers, fries, and shakes. But they do have a lot of secret items. So we're gonna go through, we got pretty much every secret item you can get. And we're gonna see. We're gonna see exactly how good or bad it is. Thank you, sir. Do you wanna jump right in with burgers? Borgor. With borgors? I mean, it's what, like, okay, yeah, one of the three things we can try. There's nothing. This is, this is classic American ham borgor. Can I say? Uh -huh. This is, is, okay, and I'm not, I'm not memeing this up. This is probably the worst looking In N Out burger I've ever seen. Really? And I've eaten In N Out, I don't know, like, I don't know, fucking 100 times. Do you ever just order a burger? I usually get like a cheeseburger, maybe double hamburger if I'm not feeling cheese, or I'm gonna get bloaty. All right, here you go. I like that. <laughs> I will say, without the cheese, I just don't feel anything. I I'm, feel that. I'm just dead inside. I feel that. So it's like, where am I now, you know? Emotionally. It was a whole lot of bite without a whole lot of sustenance. That's what it felt like. Yeah, I'm If with I you. wanna eat a goddamn salad, I go to a goddamn salad store. That's mid. And if you flew Let's imagine from Boston all the way to California and you went to In-N-Out and you got that, and you just said, let me get a hamburger. Oh, you're you're talking to the boys back in Quincy. You'd be like, you'd be like, you these fuckers in California. Fucking in and out. They don't fucking like, know anything about boygas. It's nothing like it's nothing like Mackey Mock spot. <laughs> <laughs> we did eat out of Wahlburgers. Wahlburgers there once? goes hard, yeah. When we ate there? We spent the whole time talking about how he would have stopped 9-11. <laughs> yeah, he did. There's like pictures of his movies around. It's so cringe. All right, you weren't so happy with that burger. Uh, so let's journey on over to the simple cheeseburger. Look at our adventure that we're having. Now it's a cheeseburger time. There's one slice All of right. cheese on top of the patty. You can you can see this one slice of cheese. Look at that burger. This, Great. This like just has way more color than the last one. Remember remember the old ones we did and everyone would be like, same side. Ah, oh, I'm yeah. 12. Yeah. I hope they're dead now. <laughs> so you who are 14 now. We regret doing that. I'm glad you're alive. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. It's it's so much different. What happened? Did does other burger not have sauce? Both it? had spread. Both had spread. The literal only difference is cheese. Dude, cheese is like magic. So this is the the grilled cheese. They do do a grilled cheese if you ask for it. It's like a burger without the patty. Grilled so yeah, cheese. what we're missing here is it, they put like more veggies there too. It's it has the same weight, right? Yeah. Like it has the same, like you put two of these in my hand and one of them's mead. I thought there was a patty in there. I kind of fuck with grilled cheese. It's just, it's just a Diet Coke. It's not bad. It's just not the real thing. No. If I was like trying to stay away from red meat, which I think is fine, and I think this is a great alternative. That's great. I'm fucking down to eat that, but it's still like not good for you. No. It's bread and fucking salt and cheese. I think the only reason I'd ever get that is if I was on a vegetarian kick or a no meat kick, like you were saying. Yeah. And ever like all the boys were like, let's go to In and Out. And I was like, You're like, oh no, I'm gonna have to sit in the car and fucking drink water and, and fucking go to sleep. Yeah. And not talk to anybody. That was, then, a, I was, I was so, I had a six week vegan period and I felt so cringe. Cause all socially, the boys would be like, let's go to Cane's. And I'd be like. Socially you did. Guys, the crinkle crut fries are like in fat and I can't yeah, fuck like with that. Yeah, acrylamide, it'll hurt me. It'll yeah. hurt my body. But I never wanted to say anything. So I'd go and I'd just get like a water and they're always like, what's, what's up dude? Yo, vegetarian style. Pop jam. Look, 
I'm supporting people who don't eat meat, but this is just lettuce, tomato, and then spread so below the tomato. So the mayo. spread is not vegan. So this is vegetarian. vegetarian. There's levels here. Yes. This is calories with no nutrition. It really is. Oh, oh he didn't like it. Oh, it's so sad. Dude, it's so sad. Look at the cross section. The lettuce breakdown is insane. That was sad. Do not like that. It wouldn't be worth it. No, you should just like eat some almonds instead. Yeah, just go, just wait. Go eat get somewhere some else. more good vegan that food. That was terrible. Yeah. Let's F go to the- plus, in and out The first healthy thing. This is a protein style. I used to get this all the time. This is like an LA fad, right? Like, I don't think you find this in Illinois. This is no carbs. It's raw onion, cheese, patty, tomato, and then some spread at the bottom. I've had this, it's very wet, and it's yeah. very like messy to eat. It is not funny. Usually I'll grab a fork, if I get these, right. I, I don't it's like get a them salad anymore. bowl. Yeah, and you just eat it like a like a normal human. I wonder if they'll give you a sandwich in like a bowl. There's also onion on here, which I don't know if that's additional. That's another thing about In and Out. Pisses me off. Can I get uh, this item? And they're like, "Do you want onions?" And they just make this whole song and dance about it. Do you think they're they're hyping up big onion too much? I don't know what they're doing, but it's like, why why not ask me if I want tomatoes? Go fuck yourself. It's like they made a deal for onions a long time ago. They're yeah. Just... Or they're like trying to like they're short on onions. Oh, and they're like that's why they gotta ask. Yeah. Me. And they're like, sure you don't want any because we're fucking. I don't know. I mean, we really got a lot of onions here. Just like I remember it. Very mid. It is mid. The patty adds so much. Patty does a lot. Bread is so good. Yeah, it's Bread's just delicious. Fucking, you guys are like, you, when you're a little kid, you're like, oh, bread, or I want fruit pebbles, mm. you know? No, bread, oh, it's like magic. I think it, if Desert Island's my one food. Okay, I got no fucking clue what this is. Chad, does anyone I know? I think it's the Flying Dutchman. It has to be. We yeah, know. this is like the, the protein style, but you think that like vegetables are gay. <laughs> so this is when like you you're, want protein you're like, style. You're like toxic you, as fuck. Yeah, you carry like a jug of water to the gym with a gallon. <laughs> yeah. And you go and you get me two Flying Dutchmans. <laughs> and they throw a tomato on it and you throw it back in the window. Yeah, you're like, how dare you, bro? You fire in the hole. And you're just roided out and angry. Yeah. <sighs> Maybe you didn't want to cook yourself. It's two patties. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, oh actually, you know what? I fucking like meat. You tell me not to eat meat for the rest of my life, I'm like, I'll do it, but I'll miss it. You're on your high horse a little too early. Yeah, Cause we got our big dogs. Oh, we got our bad boys. Dude, you're gonna crack the table. We got our, ooh. Oh my God. Yes, sir. This is what we call in the business, the Nick order. Yeah, oh, dude, Nick. He always complains about how constipated and gross he is. And how, he's and like, how, I can't shit. And then he goes to the drive, he's like, four by four plane. Yeah, four by four plane. I'm gonna eat it in 12 seconds right now. And it's like, maybe you're the issue. Yeah. It's not your butt. No. It's you. It's his diet. <laughs> it's what we got here is we got double, 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 double animal style, a three by three and a four by four. What is animal style? To animal a style is they put these grilled, tiny little chopped up diced onions as well as the the spread that they use, which is like a very like I think they just lather it up mustardish type of type of beat. Yeah. I will say In and Out. I'll have it every once in a while. Every time after I eat it, I feel like a fucking six hundred pound guy. This is the best looking burger we've gotten today. It really is the goat. Mm. He just likes it. Mm -hmm. Ludwig likes what he did just now. Mm -hmm. Oh. That made my day better. It's just correct. They hit, they hit it out of the park. It's just the right way to do it. That's just like when a you laugh, you lose hits the inbox and you're like, I can have this every day. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't though, I shouldn't I though, shouldn't, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. But I could. But fuck, if I man, could. If I could. If God was willing. So it that one I think was vibe. just a double double by the way. Yeah, it was. This is the animal style. Oh really? Yes. Okay. This one didn't have the grilled onions. Yeah, this is EX plus alpha. And this has, this has like the little pickles in it. Mm. You can kind of tell. It's a little more monstrous. You do have to eat them quick. That's one of the mix-ups they always hit you with. You wanna eat this in the car? I fucking quit asking me that. I don't God that. damn you, in and out employees, if you're watching this, but you probably don't because you're fucking well-adjusted and you got fucking houses and shit. Fuck you. Don't ask me if I wanna eat it in the car. You wanna eat this in the car? Put it in a goddamn bag. I, if you have it in the bag, you can still eat it in the car. Like, what the fuck are they oh, telling me? Don't tell this. me where to eat. Oh, oh, oh stop, stop, you're squeezing it. Oh, look at that. You gotta run your, your, oh, your mouth. baby. <laughs> Mm. Don't say that the burgussy is dripping, please. Mm. It's such a moist burgussy. <laughs> the grilled onions, they have a little bit of char on them. Dude, I don't know what fucking happens scientifically when an onion gets grilled, but it reaches its potential. This shit turned me to a Christian. I'm picking out my favorite Bible verses after this guy. That shit's good. It's just salt and fat. It's good. I love it so goddamn much. 
that's what I would say, like, like, do I feel good eating? Yeah. But, like, do I feel a little gross? Yeah. But that's what it wants you to do. But now we're going to three by she, three. She wants you to feel a little dirty. If that made you feel a little dirty, what's this guy making you feel like? I've never gotten this, ever. I've never gotten three by three, but he'll get it every time. I feel like bad. That's so big. I, I heard, I hear you just, I hear the burgussy when you chew down, when you bite now, I hear the juice. I don't have enough mouth. Hey, see what you think. I'll take care of her. Sorry, sorry you had to deal with him. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. God, it's so much meat. It's a lot. There's so much it's, meat. Not only is it a lot of meat, it's a lot of cheese. Obviously, three by three means three meat patties, three cheese slices. Yeah. The cheese is kind of all up in there. It's a very gooey guy. I'm working through it. I took that one bite and I feel kind of like, it's like working its way down my throat. I think, I think this is the four by four. This is as big as they went? This is as big as they go, yeah. It's almost the size of a Waterloo. So I guess I should ask Nick uh, when I when I have a moment with him, it's like, do you, when he eats his, does he just like squish it? Like, does he, or does he like get it on? Like, how does he eat his three by three? This is how. Ah, oh, just painful. Like blackheads are coming out of your nose. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> you know what you do? If a kid won't shut up, you hit him with one of these. Make me at all? They're just, they're busy. You know what I mean? Oh, they just gotta work through <laughs> like, it. I was like, I'll be here a while chewing. All right, we got our fries. It's the triple fry threat. Whip <sighs> them all out. If you're watching this video and you want to comment, you probably already said your shit. You're gonna be like, oh, the fries, they're mid. The fries are like dog water ass, ass bark. They I are. I will never eat they it are. ever. And it's like, okay, but tell me why. And I can never fucking say why. in and out fries are mid. Oh. That's true. But they're mid because they fucking just chop the potato up right there for you. And there's something to be said. Is, is food that's better for you supposed to be mid? Maybe. But should it not, because we're eating fast food anyway, maybe they should just dump that shit over and over, brother bear. That's right. I'm going to fucking in and out okay? I'm going here because I want food and I want it fast. I want MSG, I want salt, I want fat, I want grease. I want to be fucked up for a, a, when I'm fucked up on the real me, and that's when I have a Big Mac inside my bones. I want to feel like shit after. So I can safely say, and I hope you agree, these are mid. Oh yeah. So well done or not, the one's more crispy, one's not. They're already cold, they're dry. What's funny is these were cooked at the same time, but they're holding way longer. Oh. It sounds not so great, and it's because one, it's not, but two, it's been out for like 45. So anyone who's gonna be like coming at your neck, if you're an In-N-Out liker, like the fries are mid, go fuck yourself. You can just be like, yeah, I know, and stare them in the face, because what are they gonna do? And if you're going and you really want fries, there's only two styles you can try. It's well done, or it's this shit. Now we get to the part where someone at in and out HQ said, I love three things. Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, may uh -huh. salvation all of us into heaven, Lord mighty God. I like marriage between a man and a woman. And I don't mind. I just don't want it to be I called marriage. I don't want to see it. I just don't want it to be called marriage. Just call it something mm. else. And three, we need to put something on these fries to make them taste better. Mm. Enter the animal style fries. I think they sat around and they're like, our fries fucking blow. <laughs> yeah. And then someone was like, let's just put all that fucking shit on it so that it's barely even fries anymore. It's just basically knockoff poutine. You have to eat it. Yes, it is. You have to eat it with a fork. You, like eat it with, a, with a, like hands is just dumb. No. And this is my shit. I think this is my biggest guilty pleasure ever. It's just, I, I go to In-N-Out and I'm like, well, I gotta get the animal fries. The content is just spread grilled onions, cheese, fry. See, and this is your strat. You wanna get the biggest amount and you wanna put it all in your mouth at once. And then you just gluttonously chew and enjoy. Not much to say. It's just crack. It's just crack. All right, we got one final boy. Really? These are these are like 800 calories right in there. Bring, about, bring down the Australians if you don't want it. I'll have them do it. Yeah? Yeah. We can have the Australian shake break. Is this good for me? Oh, yeah. So you actually, Josh, recently had a no sugar trend, right? <laughs> me? Yeah. Yeah, it's been going really well. It's going really well, right? Mm. No sugar for the month of February. <laughs> yeah, these are sugarless shakes. Dude, I've been hearing about yeah. these recently in the news. Zero sugar in these bad boys. Oh, this is a root beer flow. 
Oh, I, I don't like that. You don't like All that? Right. All right, we'll start, start with these bad like boys. I do like this. Start with these bad boys. No, no, don't do this one yet. Don't do this one yet. You're going to hate this one. Give me the Aussie review of those bad boys. All right, boys let's, do you want the Australian review? Yeah, you guys just... Fuck Oath, mate. That's a good shake, eh? <laughs> no, I don't like hitting the culture that hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It just tastes like milk. It's vanilla. Oh. That adds up, actually. It's all right. This tastes okay. like McDonald's soft More. serve. Yeah. No, this tastes like McDonald's soft serve. I think we're gonna find they they all kind of <laughs> taste like McDonald's soft serve. They both taste like McDonald's soft serve. You can Salty tell they're sugar free. Sweet. Yeah. Yeah. You can't even taste the sugar really. Yeah, that's uh, that's yeah. good. That's great. Mm, the chocolate's flames though. The chocolate goes pretty hard. I reckon these are worse than like shakes you get from like the fish and chip shop back home. So there's some fucking fight. Have you ever had a lime shake? No. Dude. Yeah, we have we have messed up. Speak to that. Yeah, lime what is that? Dude, lime shakes. It's. I mean, what what more do you want? It's just a it's a shake with lime flavoring in so it. So it's dude. like it's like a milk based frozen product oh. that's lime flavored. So good, man. Oh. It's actually good. Oh. We have saute shakes as well. Oh my god, that's so yeah. Saute. You know, like saute. Saute, like sauteing something. No, you know, like the peanut sauce. Like you get at Thai places, saute. This is not a thing. <laughs> no, let me run the bit first, man. For me, Choc is S, 100%. Vanilla, I just hate strawberry, but this also just tastes like shit strawberry. And vanilla was mid. But I do want to try the- Wait, Miles, what's yours? Oh, you go first. Yeah, pretty much the same. I think same. if you are a strawberry guy though, it's good strawberry flavor. I'm just not a strawberry guy Strawberry is very particular. Mm. And this is a secret item. It's the root beer float. That, that's actually <laughs> fucked. I'm going to hate this. <gasps> that actually hurts. <laughs> All right. It's so fucking chat. That is disgusting. That is, is the worst thing I've ever done. Yeah, that is fucking. Don't smile. No. <laughs> don't, don't, he's like, he's like, mm, yeah. Mm. It's fucking awful. Dude, it tastes like. I need fucking chips to wash that. Cigarette out. ash. Yeah, it tastes like cigarette ash. Yeah, a little bit, but that's like what's charming about it. I what's say floating that? in there, buddy? Uh, all right, well, that's, that's it, fellas. That's all I got for you guys. Dude. Cool. Thanks for the Australian review. Here it is. I'll show you what happens after uh, eating a menu stream. Nothing a garbage bag and a little bit of time and elbow grease can't fix.